Here's Kevin Rousseau on the takeoff roll. Kevin Rousseau is standing up first. Kevin was born in Montreal, Canada, and now makes his home here in North Branch, New Jersey, with his daughter Spencer, who is now 10 years old. And let me tell you what, he's got over 19,000 hours flying military aircraft, airliners, and corporate aircraft. Here comes Kevin Rousseau with the North American 86 SMJ. Keep your eyes on Kevin Rousseau as he pulls up gracefully with the T6 and rolls it over into a quarter closer. Back to straight. Pulls back on the stick, coming over the top, hanging by the belts. Kevin is weightless right now. Oh, what a beautiful way to be flying today here at Greenwood. stick hard over to the left it's a simple maneuver called an aileron roll but notice how slowly this airplane rolls over now the t6 smj is fully aerobatic however it is not comparable to the state-of-the-art airplanes that we have today from the right here comes kevin rousseau with the north american smj Kevin's airplane is actually an SMJ-5, one of the lowest SMJs in the world. This airplane has a little over 5,000 hours on it. And while Kevin is up there flying around, we want to remind you that the property here at the Greenwood Lake Air Show, there is no smoking on the property here. around here with aviation fuel in them and you do not want to have a bad day. So please, no smoking here at the Greenwood Lake Air Show. We thank you. Kevin Rousseau heading off into the distance there after performing two inside or barnstorming bar barn loops. Let's count the points and watch how slowly this happens. Here's three. Here's four points of the four-point hesitation roll. Now all that beautiful sound that you're hearing there is a 1,600 horsepower Pratt & Whitney R1340 cubic inch radial engine. It's called a radial because the cylinders are arranged in a circle. the speed of sound. That's that slapping you hear. That low throaty rumble is actually the engine. Up onto the vertical as he's coming over the top once again. Hanging by the belts. Going to roll the airplane out. That's with the stick hard over everybody. Remember this airplane was state of the art over 70 years ago. Pulls back on the stick once again, hanging by the belts at the top of that loop. Smoke looking real good here today against this puffy white cloud shot. Back to straight level. Oh, he just loves doing vertical maneuvers for this airplane. He's going to do a half cubic it, watch for the rollout, and there it is. And I'll bet she's going to roll it one more time. There he goes. You know, the beautiful part about this airplane is that I always thought this thing was a lumbering beast, and I couldn't have been more wrong. This is a very gentle, very easy-to-fly airplane. 
The control forces are very much harmonized. This is an easy to fly airplane. How do I know? I logged an hour in a T6 many years ago. Coming in from the left, let's keep an eye. Let's count the points as they happen. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That is the eight point hesitation roll. I almost started counting nine, ten. Oh, Come on, Fast Daddy, get it together, buddy. Kevin Rousseau is going to do a wing over right here to bring this T6 around. T6 SNJ, the British called them the Harvard. Brings the airplane around. Beautiful pitch up. Here in New Jersey, here comes the next maneuver. This is called a barrel roll. When you roll the airplane, you feel a little bit of elevator, a little bit of rudder into it, and it describes the outside of a barrel in the sky. Coming up for his next maneuver, you better peel off your shoes and socks to count all the points. You're gonna need them. You've seen the four point. You've seen the eight point. You're asking Fast Daddy, how can it get more interesting than that? Very easy. Coming in from the left, Kevin Rousseau, the 16-point hesitation roll starting now. 16. And I'm a little slow on the count, but I know he did them all. Oh, and it only gets worse than that. Did you know that there is actually a 32-point hesitation roll? We are not going to do that here. Sorry about that. Coming back around from the left, I'm going to let you listen to the engine this time. Let's listen to the sound around. cubic inches, 600 seating horsepower in this airplane here. Coming back around, I believe somewhere along the line here, he's going to say, he just did a loop and an element, he's getting set up for his photo pass. Ladies and gentlemen, get those cameras and camcorders ready. Those of you with pencil and paper, get ready to do a real quick sketch. Kevin Rousseau is going to bring this SNJ around for the photo pass. I hear he's going to do two of them. Aren't we lucky? Alright, here we go. What I understand is he's going to do two photo passes. They're both going to come in from Air Show Right. Get your cameras, camcorders, and anything else that you can record this event with ready. I see people out there with iPads. That's pretty cool. Ladies and gentlemen, coming in from the right, from behind us, well, not quite that far behind, here comes Kevin Russo, the North American SNJ with the photo pass. What a pretty looking airplane. I love the paint job on this airplane. Now, he's going to go around, and for those of you who didn't get enough pictures the first time, Kevin Rousseau is going to bring the airplane around. He's going to do it again. Oh, yeah, same direction, too, everybody. Going to sneak around behind us here. And then afterwards, Kevin Rousseau is going to depart the area. He's got another air show that he's going to fly to today and do his routine. He will be back here again tomorrow. Here's that last photo pass, everybody. SNJ5. Kevin, you have a safe trip home. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you.